in the last year or so, we got this Kingcraft generator. It was pulled out of an Aldi's dumpster. Let's see if we can get it going. Let's check our fuel first. It's got some in there. It doesn't smell terrible. We'll come down here and check our oil. That looks good. Make sure that the switch is on. We want to turn our fuel to the on position. We found out the reason this was pitched was the float was never set appropriately and fuel was just coming out of this hole. Well, do you think it's just going to fire up? I have a feeling we're going to take this air breather off and tickle it with some fresh gas to get it to fire. But our switch is on, full choke. How many do you think? <laughs> do we're going to try this little Remington pole saw and see if this generator has the power to run it because I just bought this property behind my shop and as you can see it's going to need a lot of trimming I do have an electric pole saw and we're going to use that quite a bit but I want to know if this little setup would work as a backup Of, we're gonna have to set this thing to run a little bit higher. Okay, I turn this big screw in a bit. Okay, so that's a viable option. And for some reason we're running with half choke. Hold on. Well, I found out that this guy, all the way over, almost chokes it again, so it needs to be right about there. There we go. Okay, cool. Seems like we have a viable option. <laughs> Leave a like and subscribe for more. She still runs.